Well, how do that, Johns? Did you think I was moving in slow motion? Yeah, so I was just me moving very slowly. I know, cunning, right? Anyway, I'm playing No Man's Sky today. People in the view of us, I guess I am. I'm going to be just debriefing my uh, frigates. But then as soon as I've finished debriefing my frigates, I'm going to do something crazy. Crazy people. I guess. Let's go debrief them. You're probably wondering, what are you going to do that's crazy, Captain of the Steves? I will show you in a moment, people. So I've got this lovely, lovely freighter. As you can see here, it's nicely lined out. I've got like this little desk here where I do like my my news is from. I do my news is from here. But um, yeah, it can be a little bit busy inside of here with a lot of noise. I mean, sometimes they, these, these guys, they make quite a lot of noise on here as well. But I don't think it's the best backdrop for news. Now, I have got quite a lot when it comes to my freighter layout. It's not just this one room. Look, I'll show you over here. Look, you go outside and I've got this giant news desk here. But I think this is a bit cluttered. A little bit, it needs a rework. And then over here, I've got all the hydroponics and I've got like... Um, farms and stuff out there as well but i'm not overly into my freighter build so you want to know what i'm going to do that's a little bit crazy i'm going to delete it i'm going to delete it i'm in creative mode so you know i can sort this out anyway so let's just head on over here so to delete my freighter build i interact with this and i'm going to go to reset freighter base it's going to say are you sure yes gone there we go people it's all gone my freighter base is gone all right, cool. Well, now I can now start building it all again. Yes, I know. Crazy, right? I'm going to stick another little save point there. Make a save. So it's definitely gone forever. And you know what? I like to delete what's already here. Boom, boom, boom. And I've just got a bulkhead now. Right. I'm going to start building out my freighter, people. So I do like having the scanner quite close to the actual bridge anyway. So that's the scanner room. So I'm going to make sure that's back in anyhow. So we've got the scanner room in, people. And that's kind of what I need anyway. But I, I need to have like a little newsy type desk now, don't I? I'm thinking maybe go outside for that. But I also technically would still want a little area here for fleet command, you know, so I can send my frigates out just in case I get any more frigates. So I'm just going to put two desks there for now because I very rarely send more than one out because I've got a full frigate command. So I don't really need much more than that at the moment, which is all well and good. Right. -o. OK. Also, what I also like, I like to have a teleporter. But the thing is, I want to make this feel like a real ship. So I want to make an actual teleporter room. It might take me a little bit longer to get there. But, you know, why the fudge not? So anyways, now I'm going to take this outside, I think, people. So what I need now is just one of these like little corridors. Now, if I put that there, is it going to give me a door automatically? No, it freaking isn't, is it? All right. OK, well, let's put a door there then. Straight away, a door. And then I'm going to be looking at building my news desk just out here, I think, people. So exterior platform. Nope, that's not going to work. OK, fine. I'll have to use the walkway first then, people. What the fudge is going on? All right, I'm just going to build menu. and Let's see what's going on from the back here. There we go. That's better. Right, now can I have my exterior platform, please? Yes, I can. Does it grow? Yes, it should do. It should do. There we are. Sweet. And I'm thinking this area here is going to be my news desk. That's the most important area for me is my news desk. And then behind me, actually, let's make it let's make it nice and big. So we've got a real nice big area for my news desk. And then off to the sides of this, I'm thinking maybe I might have some side rooms. Yeah, we'll have some side rooms because that might increase the traffic. So I put one side room here, one side room there. And I'm thinking maybe have the more of these just in case I ever need them. How? Why won't that build there? What the? F Why not? Why won't that go there? That's a bit weird. One per base. Oh, I chose the wrong freaking thing, didn't I? So that's not what I'm after. I'm after one of these frigate control rooms. That's it. So I can delete that over there. We don't need that. Delete that. And we'll put another frigate control room. Frigate control room. Frigate room. And we'll do the same there. So if I do want to send out more, I can. I need to put doors in there so we can get into the dang place, don't I? So here we are. Door, door, door. Where are you? Doors. I'll stick that there. Chicka power. And put that there. 
All right. Well, you know what? I could probably continue on with this, and I'll come back to you in a moment when I start putting in more interesting things. Okay, chum, so I've done a little bit since she was last here. I've put in windons all the way around here, so when you go inside of these side rooms that you saw me building, I have the actual you know, fleet command stations, but I've also got all my storage all the way around the outside, and I've added windows all the way around the outside as well, so you can see the frigates and stuff. And I've added in a pathway going up here. This is going to be my technology area up here, people. I have to do a little jump there. There's my science terminal. We've got the Exocraft sort of beaming tool there. Teleporter there. Galactic Trade Terminal. My appearance modifier. And we've also got our Exocraft technician up there. So that's also like the sciencey area and also excursions for away missions. In here we've got our sort of, I know, sort of aquaponics area and uh, farming area for all of our nutrient resources and stuff. We've also got a nutrient processor there and a chef, I guess. Head on down here and across this little walkway. This takes us into the industrial area, like the engines and whatnot. And we've also got our overseer terminal here. Let's call in the overseer. Hello there, Tylee. Welcome, welcome. Head on over this way. Oh, Gar's not at his station either. Let's call in good old Gar. Oops, wrong one. Where's Gar? Okay, um, he should be here. There should be a weapons guy here. But for whatever reason, it's not giving me the option to bring him in. Oh, there you go. There he is. Boom! Hello, Gar. Yeah, there's Gar. Awesome. So we've got a load of refiners in here as well. Nice. And then back across here. This is where I'm going to build, build my news desks. So that's pretty much the layout of my freighter. I've kept it small. I've kept it compact. I've kept it simple. What I haven't got in here is the captain's quarters to show off all of my sort of, you know, exploits and stuff around the verse, which I might build something. And if I do, it'll probably be off the back of that um, technology suite at the top there. I'll probably have a captain's quarters out back. But for here, I just want to build my news desks. Now I'm going to build my news desk and I'll be right back with you in a moment. Okay, jumps. Well, I think I've built a pretty cool news desk. The only thing is, you can hear Viking sort of croaking all the frickin' time. Anyway, shall we see how this looks, people? Let's go into camera mode. So into this mode here. And we'll see if that looks okay with me in the news desk. One second. Let's take me off of there. Put me into there. Let's just uh, move me into position. There we go, people. How cool is that? And I can take out that uh, laptop green screen if I wanted to. There we go. So there I am at my news desk. I need to sort of move back a bit so you can see the whole news desk. And then uh, me, I just need to move me around. So, hold on. There I am. Ah, wrong one. Let's uh, grab me and let's move me there. Okay. I think that works. And uh, the actual laptop screen. Laptop screen. Laptop... Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway, there I am at the news desk. Hello there, people. Welcome, welcome. Salute to Mondo and all that sort of jazz. Yeah, so... I think that kind of works. Uh, I mean, I don't think you can actually see me on the screen now, can you? I don't know whether you can or can't. I think you can. I think you can see me. Yeah, hello. Hello, it's me. I'm not quite in the centre there. There we are. Now I am. That's better. Now my arm shouldn't... Oh, it does clip if I move my arm too much that way. But that's okay, isn't it? That, that's pretty cool. Me on my nearest desk. But yeah, I don't think I can... It's the Viking sounds all the time. I was just doing my head in. Everybody makes those noises. I mean, there's a Gek walking behind me right now making Viking noises, people. Work that one out. And that's why I don't like doing these news desks down on planet, because it makes all this noise. I might have to make a news desk in a base. Yeah, that's got no NPCs. It's a shame, though, because I like seeing the NPCs walking around and doing their day-to-day -day in the background and stuff, people. Anyway, let's, um, let's take me off the screen now, because I think that's kind of, you know, a little bit weird, isn't it? Anyway, let's... Uh, yep, so goodbye, me. Boom. And hello again. There you go. I'm back again now, people. Dundily and done. Oh, it's brought in the view counter there, hasn't it? But yeah, I think you get the idea, people. So there we go. I've gone and rebuilt my base on my freighter 
probably didn't need to because yeah like i say all you hear is by key in every five seconds and that's exactly what's happening down at my archive news desks as well but i think this works quite nicely i haven't built a captain's quarters yet i probably do that after the next expedition we've got another badge or something not in any ru rush to do that but yeah i think i need to make a news desk on a really cool planet that hasn't got any sort of weird sounds to it and one that hasn't got a lot of movement either because at my archive basis when well, thank you, XA. Cheers for that. Yes, whenever I land at um, my uh, archive bases, the news desk moves a bit and I end up floating above it as well. So there's, there's problems with doing news inside of game. What's all that sound about out here as well? Where's that weird sound coming from? Is that making that sound? I don't know. I don't know what's making that weird sound. But anyway, it's nice to have all the frigates and stuff in the background while I'm doing my news, but it's not like you can overly see that. I'd have to build a proper news desk at a base, people. But anyway, today, I haven't really sent any frigate missions out as yet. Let's just hit a save. I haven't learnt any new words. I haven't done any of that. I've just spent my time redoing my freighter base. Sorry, people, I needed to sneeze then. There you go. View potential expeditions. Uh, I'm probably going to send out this one. It's a two hour one. I'll come back to it tomorrow, people. So let's go and see how we're getting on. We've still got these three that we're trying to upgrade. Now they're a five star on their own. Don't have to put anything with them. Away you go. Lovely jubbly. Right. Well, I'll go and hit on up a save. And hopefully we'll see those come back again soon. Where's my base just disappeared to? Oh, you're having a laugh. Has it all just vanished on me? People, that shouldn't have been a thing. Um, did you just delete my base? Yeah, you can wave all you like. If we can give you your P45, mate. Let's just go back up there and see if it's back again. Yes, it's back. Fudging heck. I thought I'd lost my whole freaking base then for a second, people, that I just built. There we go. So at least we've got one command station there. We've got our little sort of probe there. And anything else we need is up there, up that ramp, which is cool. I can live with that. That's all good. And I've got like a temporary news desk here. It can get a little bit noisy thanks to the Viking sound effects. Yeah, hello, Viking dude. Yeah, just walk straight through me. Why don't you? Yeah. Hello, mate. All right, cool. We're done anyway. That's pretty much this video in a nutshell, people. I made a base on my freighter. I redone my freighter base. So there you go, people. I hope you like my new freighter base. In fact, sound off inside the comments. Let me know if you liked my new freighter base more than my old freighter base. This is where I find out that you will like my old one more. Yeah, probably the case. Anyway, I'm happy with it, so that's all that really matters. But anyway, what does matter is you hitting that subscribe button. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, it's it's one that says subscribe on it. Please click that. Thank you. Until next time. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again.